Hello and welcome to Wolfman Gaming. This is my Dark Pictures Anthology Devil in Me Blind Playthrough. And we are out. <laughs> we faked an Maybe injury and we are out exploring the back corners of this island. Which Mr. Dumet probably doesn't want us to explore. And we have found a little hut and I think I just found the back way to get into it. Because the door is locked and... Ooh, what's this? Oh, janky controls. Uh, Jesus. Ah. That is a very dead squirrel. <laughs> very nice. <laughs> Not at all disgusting. <laughs> so let's see what's in here. I heard you were looking for a new place. Oh, sure premonition. Okay. Turned. Well, it's good to find these premonitions. Hopefully, they can help. I'm not entirely sure that they will, but doesn't hurt. Mediterranean Cruise 21. Looks like you met has a family. Ah. But why is that photo out here in this little murder cabin. Bird spotting, a spotter's guide to birds of the British Isles. An in-depth guide to the birds that live and mi live in and migrate to the British Isles. Easily identify birds with color photographs, discover where you can find each species, and learn about their unique personalities from expert bird watchers. Once you find some feathered friends, you can make your own observations using the handy notes section provided. Be sure to look for our other publications, including It's a Bird's World, Following the World's Most Sought After Birds, A Guide to Traveling the UK and Beyond in Search of the Great Birds of the World. Is that some kind of collectibles you can find in this game, perhaps? It just occurred to me that opening that door may have been a mistake. Because if we're trying to do this sneaky without Mr. Dumet finding out, maybe we should have left that door closed. Because if he has a photo of his family what about over there? in that little cabin, perhaps he doesn't want... He'll come back there, is what I'm trying to say. wanted to go on nature hikes, I wouldn't have moved to the Do you see, there was one of those this odd transitions again. That is again. not me pressing anything to skip any parts of cutscenes, just so we're clear on that. It's just very odd. Feels like there's two frame glitch. But I must say, it's been quite some time since I played any of the other games in the series but it feels like this is a bit slower slower to start than the other games see there's nothing here nothing to interact with so I guess we're heading up to go across the roof Reminds me of shit summer camps. 
locked and there doesn't seem to okay if I can get the car moving and stop it here we'll be able to get across you see the control panel it's trash I don't even think there's power But can we interact with it? No. Oh, Kate. Uh. There's nothing I can do right now. I tried every button. Can we get in here? No. Aha. Uh -huh. Something over there. Let's see. What about over there? We're going down there to power up the tram. So first we're gonna head up here and see what this is. Hm. Ooh, not rollable. Wow. Six more obols. I'm wondering if I can use them at special times. Like, do I have to do it? Because we, in the previous games, you've gone into these little intermissions when you're talking to the curator. And uh, maybe that's the only time I can use them. Maybe we can get this thing working. Let's see. Move the train car. Can we? No. Okay. Nothing more to find in there. So let's see if we can get these fuses going. Jamie, can you fix this? Well, it doesn't look super hard. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, now I get it. First we do this. Okay. The wiring here is ancient. Follow the arrows and don't go out of sequence unless you want to trip the whole system. You're welcome in advance. I thought I did, but because but maybe I messed up <laughs> due to flipping one of them accidentally. What am I doing wrong? Am I supposed to flip that one first, perhaps? Let's see. Do that one, that one, that one. 
that one. There we go. Yeah, you could have like done a one in front of the single one. Because it wasn't very obvious that you had to flip the bottom left one first. But either way, no sense in sulking about that. We got, <laughs> we got the train working, so let's see if we can head further up. Oh, we couldn't head further up. No, we could just go to the other side. Of course. What's through here? Hear that? Okay. Well, that was easy at least. <laughs> I'm guessing most of uh, these hiding puzzles will probably not be as easy going further into the game. Wonder what these are. Warning hazardous substance. Can we pick up the note? Apparently not. And while we're exploring this island, I'm very excited going into this year's autumn of 2023 because there are a lot of games coming out. I have made a little note in my phone about all the games and I think at this point I have like seven games I want to buy that have confirmed release dates like from the end of August going into October. Hey. Ah. Oh. Oh god, that's so much better. I guess I just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. If I'm a short person, <laughs> I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Dumet. We're all here now. Let's head on. Everyone stay. Because games like Lies of P of and uh, Armored Core 6 haven't played any of the Armored Core games hey. to date. But this new think? one seems really cool. And being Some a big fan of the Dark Souls series. Whatever. We're gonna find out what's up I'm very excited about it. And also what is else that's coming out? Blasphemous 2 is coming out. Ghost Runner 2. A lot of games. <laughs> which is going to be super fun to play. And uh, uh -oh. very expensive. Since You're the price of games have really <laughs> gone up with this generation. <laughs> but I'm very excited. And I'm also interested. Are there any game releases you are really <laughs> looking forward to? Please let me know down in the comments. It's always great to hear input from you viewers. Yes, yes it is. Uh, let's be empathetic. You can do it. Eyes forward. Don't look down. I got it. It's fine. Is it though? Because being cheery in a situation it's like just that. Water down there. You can swim. Besides, the bridge looks dependable ish. Come on, I'll help. It has strengthened their That's bond. It. Look, it's fine. Okay. Don't look down. Yeah. <laughs> See? 
so bad. And then he plummets to his death. No. <sighs> Thank you. You always knew how to get me through the shit, didn't you? We should catch up to Mr. Dumet. Wow. <laughs> Where is Dude, you oh, just uh, got friend zoned. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. Because having played these games, I think if I had chosen Cheery, it could have been one of those instances where she tries to joke and he gets offended and their, their relationship kind of like plummets. <laughs> Which will probably fuck me over later on in the game. So always try to stay away. Because I'm going to try to keep the relationship in between this character as well as I possibly can. And it may go completely pear-shaped. I don't know. But hopefully at least my goal here is to have at least more survivors than I did in House of Ashes. So we have to have more than two people coming out of this alive. And hopefully I didn't jinx it <laughs> by saying that. Hello. Wonder who you are. What are you doing? I I saw a little girl. Well that must be Dumet's there. daughter. Maybe it's your one fan. And now she's lost forever. You are such a dick. <laughs> Everything in here is fragile. Please be careful. I feel that Mr. Dumet is... For having invited them, he doesn't seem like he wants to have them there at all. Would you all mind signing in at the desk, please? Uh, this isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I'll, I'll make sure it gets to your rooms. Kate's makeup taste is slowing it down. <laughs> Aaron, cigarette. Blue backpack. Settle in, and I'll meet you all at dinner. At ease. Mr. Dumet, I cannot say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? <laughs> I told you. I'm not sure this is a good plan. <laughs> Actually, I'm quite sure of it, that it isn't. So this is supposed to be, it looks like a replica of the original hotel. That's the thing with, uh, with these blind playthroughs. That's the point, I go into this blind. So I don't know much about this game. All I knew going into this was that it was revolving something to do with H.H. Oh, H. Holmes. There you are. Busy, busy, busy. You've been out and about all day. And I have to sit here worrying. Gone all day and not a word from you. Five bucks says that's a corpse. Because that felt very Norman Batesy. No! <laughs> Sorry. You're jumpy. Oh my god. I think I peed a little. How did you not hear me coming? <laughs> I was. I don't think we're the only ones here. Yeah, Kate saw a little girl looking out a window at us when we were outside. That's who I saw. A little girl. Mr. Demet probably has family, a staff, maybe friends. Who knows? That said, this place does give me the willies. It's, um, it's unique. Are you singing? Oh, yeah, that's my being scared song. What? This is my don't be scared song. Sing it and I won't be scared long. <laughs> Doesn't really work. I bet. 
181. Uh, I think I'm around the corner. 183? This is me. Okay. Okay. Good luck out there. Don't get lost. Scream if you need me for anything. Thanks. I got you. Nothing to be scared of. Actually, hey. Yeah? Why don't you hang a second while I unpack, then I can help you find your room? Something about this place makes me want to use the buddy system. Yes, <laughs> thanks. I'd end up lost, probably. It's just a hall, dude. And here we are. Well, it's, um, cozy? Let's be playful. Mm, cozy is fun. If we have to double up like last time, it's a matter of my morning. You talk in your sleep. Not sure I ever told you that. Sure. Ooh. What did I say? Relationship Actually, updated. Actually, it was just a bunch of incoherent swearing. Oh. So their awake. relationship I has was improved. Reading Kate's social media posts. Ugh, that bitch. Okay, don't hate me, but she's been kind of nice to me. I mean, I think she's more upset about Mark than she lets on. Lies. She's a robot. I must say, the script in this uh, game could Wait, what? Old school. need some work. Uh, drug school? What if I have to pee in the middle of the night? Am I going to walk in on Charlie sitting on the pot? Guess that means there's no mini bar either. Oh. Show us what you know. What is that? Wine. Genius. Uh, I feel like if we start drinking, Charlie will find out and lecture me and make me feel like an asshole again. Yeah, he does that. But we're not on the clock. Not until we're rigging to shoot. Which is hard to do drunk. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> suggesting we get full on hammered before we work. Why are you doing that? I'm thirsty. Also, you're cute when you're worked up. I don't... Cute? You think I'm Ooh. cute? Hmm? Is there some attraction oh. there going on, perhaps? Uh, let's be familiar. Gotta stick on my own if you want to share a lip cootie. Thanks, but I can find mine. Mm-hmm. I think there is some kind Where's of attraction that? going on between these two. It's uh, all the way against the wall. See it? <coughs> you okay? <coughs> Shit. You trying to scare me now? <coughs> no. Revenge? Cause it's dust. Job. Aaron can use her inhaler to stop asthma attacks. Shit, is that gonna be a factor? Let's be concerned. You sure you're okay? Cause, yeah, maybe me scaring you didn't help, did it? No. But seriously, it's not your fault. I just, I, I try to pretend like it isn't a thing, you know? Like, I don't want to be depending on an inhaler. I try to mind over matter it, but dust and allergies and... Moving into an old murder up. castle. You sure? Sure. <laughs> I'm sure. So Are you sure? I'm sure. Yeah. Cozy. <laughs> you gonna try that? Why not? And now you're poisoned. Not that bad. You're not lying. It's piquant. Decent uh -huh. vintage. Sure. I'm getting oaky undertones. A hint of citrus. Like one time when I swiped a bottle of white wine from <laughs> my mom. And, and I want to say a strong, healthy amount of moldy sweat dots. <laughs> Yes. Oh God, I hate you. You are such a liar. Let's be flirtatious. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant the thinking you were cute thing. Really? Um, if my cheeks are red, it's from this wine, uh -huh. not because I am bashful. I swear. Really? Sorry. Didn't mean to make you feel weird. 
I, I, yeah, it's just, we work together and Charlie is always on me about being more professional and- I get it. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying I don't appreciate it. Uh -huh. um, or that I don't think you're cute too. It's just, um. Moving. This one of those you snooze, you lose moments. What are you doing? I, oh what? my god, I, uh, I... <laughs> oh, you bitch! <laughs> I'm just fucking with you. I wanted to kiss you for months. I just was scared to make a real move. There we go. Sparks. Trophy. Well, that's nice. Oh, sorry. Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> Got a bit excited. Special feature unlocked. Who is that? Who knows? <sighs> you perv. Enjoying yourself out here like some sort of pervert? <laughs> Sorry, I wrote I, this. Uh, interrupt something here. No, we're just talking shop. Uh -huh. Worried about the power grid handling all of our gear. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if this place is running on a generator, we need to know what it's putting out. I don't care what you guys are doing. Then why are you lurking? I can't find my room, and I need a fucking cigarette. <laughs> These funny shapes are numbers. They go up and down in order. Thank you. I've just been down there. Look, give me ten, then we should get a rough plan for getting our first shot. We have all evening. Can we plan after dinner? I'd like to chill for a minute after the trek getting here. I want to be shooting after dinner. You've got ten minutes. Okay. Okay. We'll be down in a few then. Oh, Erin, I checked my blue bag. No cigarettes. That's where I put them. Come and show me. Maybe one of us is colorblind and doesn't know what a blue bag is. Don't be a dick. To be continued, then? Yes. Definitely. Good luck finding your rooms. Okay, is this some kind of thing that... Where the hell are they going? Hmm. And I'm gonna end this episode right here, but uh, so we'll see what happens in the next one. But I want to thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again in my next video. So until next time, this is Wolfman signing off.